Hey everybody, and welcome to part 6 of Spyro Year of the Dragon. Let's talk to Moneybags. Ah, my good friend Spyro. The sorceress caught this naughty bird letting off rockets in her fireworks factory, but I'm willing to release him into your custody, provided you pay his outstanding fine. Funny thing is, the fireworks factory has nothing to do with James Bird, and it also uh, is a level in the future. 700 gems, oh my god, Bird. <laughs> what a sucker. Uh, that is, it's a far, far better thing you do today, Spyro, than you have ever done, and, uh, well, so forth, etc. You get the idea. Jackass. Bird. James Bird. I think he's supposed to be like a play on to James Bond. Sergeant Bird, 90068. Awaiting orders, sir. Uh, I think you'll have to find your commanding officer for that. Hey, what are those things? These are the latest military hardware. DBX 9 rocket launchers, state of the art. So why didn't you use them to escape? Because. Because I have limited ammo, and I wanted to conserve it. For this. <laughs> Say, where'd you come from? I thought dragons had all been dead for a thousand years or something. Well, the rumors of our extinction were slightly exaggerated. We just wanted a little peace and quiet. Well, if it's peace and quiet you want, you should stay clear of my homeworld for a bit. I reckon I'll be blowing up Rhinox for weeks. Cheerio! <laughs> Ah, nice. Sorry, I'm just picking numbers. There we go. I picked. The, I had to pick numbers for my girlfriend. Anyways, let's go to Sergeant Bird's base. No money because apparently, after a cutscene, money totals don't do the same thing as they normally do. So. Let's go to Bur Sergeant Bird's base. I have to train the hummingbirds. They must be in peak physical condition if we're going to take on the sorceress. Wow, that's uh, very descriptive. Woo. Let's get it on. Okay, so here we have... 500 gems. Yeah, clearly the build. So it did change based on the world. Just not the home world itself. Now this guy, you have to hold down X to fly circle to shoot your unlimited ammo. Yeah, he didn't have conserved ammo, so he's lying to us. And, uh, yeah, everything else is literally the exact same. Our mission is to free these hummingbirds by stopping these evil rhinox that apparently planting flowers, because that's a big deal. Planting flowers means the end of the world for these hummingbirds. I know hummingbirds like flowers, but are they laced with poison or not? Because, ow, hang on a second. I just broke my headset again by goddamn pushing on it. There we go. Ow. God damn it! I keep hitting it. Like, there we go. It should work. Oh my god! I keep hitting it. No, buddy, don't. No, no, no. Stay down. Eh. Did it work? There we go. Jeez Louise. Gotta hate it. It's it's such a bad headset. Wait, why am I back down here? Didn't I go up? Sorry, this this video got a little rough for a second. I don't even know how I ended up down. Nobody get off my goddamn recording equipment! No, now I have a cat crawling on everything. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Get down. Thank you. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's going on today, guys. Everyone's being brats. Oh, I thought I was gonna take damage from them. Hey, I shot the door. Now you can shoot these balloons with your missiles, and they'll pop the vase in. Whoa, that was a big gem that came out of there, and we almost got hit twice by these guys. But remember, this is actually a very short level with a lot of gems. Now we have to come back for that uh, that giant, uh, whatchamacallit, I guess glass vase thing. Now there's a skill point for destroying all the moles. Though, I don't know why a lot of YouTubers go back and get all the skill points. In this game, unlike other games with skill points, they literally mean nothing. Like, they don't do anything for you. 
What's with the weird gong like music in the background? Oh, what's this? Sir, I've captured the enemy rations. They won't march far on an empty stomach. When she said rations, I thought she said Russians. And what is our egg? Siegfried! I don't really know anyone named Siegfried. Sir, the Rhinox have blocked the way out of this next cave with a security door, and I don't think you'll be able to blast your way through this one. Recommend you land on the weights and carry them to the pressure sensitive security switches either side of the door. When in position, press the square button to drop the weight. Press the triangle button once to look down. Press it again to look up, sir. Okay, why did you have to tell me lots of different things? But yeah, so apparently the hummingbirds are French. You just have to, like, literally land on them. Not that much, uh, skill required. But anyway, I didn't want to... I didn't actually want to grab... Can you stop? I didn't want to grab it. Okay, you know what? This level's becoming bullshit because I'm not wanting to pick anything up, but for some reason, Bird keeps picking shit up. First of all, let's grab some health here from this Ladybug of Doom. Five-star Ladybug of Doom. Hey, buddy. My kitty's just hopping up on the chair beside me. Hey, free one up. Don't mind if I do. I'm always open for free lives. All lives matter, not just black lives, guys. Every life matters. I don't know why people make the big fuss that, you know, you have to be different. We're all just human, right? And I'm pretty sure there's a balloon or something up here. Yep, right there. Pop. There's some big money. Get nothing else in here, so let's go grab that weight and put it on the door. Because I also do want to get, hopefully get down the uh, Sparks level and the rest of um, Molten Crater done in this episode. Get out of the way, Zoe. I'm trying to defeat some enemies here. These guys got blow darts. Or blow suction cups, apparently. God damn you. They're so annoying to deal with. Ow, can you stop the hitting me? Like, Sergeant Bird's level is just bullshit. Like, he probably won't die because there's lots of health, but the amount of damage you take is crazy. Now, I'm pretty sure, once again, there's also hidden stuff up in the ceiling. Yep. Gotta check every which way for these things, man. That's the other one. Boop. Nah, I always think I can kill them off, but I can't. Yeah, where's that other gem? Oh, there it is. It's a green gem. Yay! Probably, like... There we go. Man, there's nothing I can do about that. He just homes in on you. Money! See, there's like a lot of health just in one area. Mission accomplished. It's great to have you back, sir. Oh, thank you. Gabriel. And your Ryan Lee. What kind of name is that? Eh, right, I'm cool with it. Yum. God damn it, he got me. Oh, it actually killed him. Sweet. So now we can go in here. Through all of this fiery demise. As long as you just time it right, you can fly through everything without harm. Ow, I did not time that correctly. I was getting too much momentum there for a second. Almost ran into more fire. Yeah, we only have two more left to go. Well, I don't know how I th flew through that, man. Aha! You guys cannot stop me. Um, again, I just threw, threw, flew through the fire. I don't know how that happens. I really don't. Okay, now you can pick up these little bombs, and that's how we destroy, like, the glass vases or cracked floors or anything like that, though. The bombs aren't really used much in the game. I feel like they're one of those concepts that were kind of just there because they had to do something for this level. That was about it. No, why are you... Don't destroy that. Destroy the one with the life in it. Ladybug lives matter too, don't you know? Silly game. 
don't know, this is, honestly, I even prefer Enchanted Towers over this. Enchanted Towers is just a long level, and I watched a YouTuber who literally took an hour to do it. I'm like, it's not that hard of a level. It's annoying, but not that hard. Haha. <laughs> totally smoked him one. That's what the stoner said. <laughs> oh, hey, we actually got one, and they sounded like a lizard, not a mole. Clearly they're moles, but they did not sound like one. Well, that's a lot of money that pooped out of that one. There's one random enemy in here. Did we, like, randomly miss you? I don't know if we randomly missed him or if we just didn't come in this way. Yeah, I think we came in this way, but we didn't come in the other side. Oh, sometimes it's really hard to tell in this, you know? Now, the, the final hummingbird is actually in a secret area that a lot of people don't know about. But if you pay attention to where all the gems are in the game, you would know. And things are going beautifully here. I don't know how it's just flying into the cage frees them, you know? Seems a little weird and phony, but... <laughs> I'm not going to complain about it. I'm gonna just drop these so I can get some full ones. I guess you can only have four. Honestly thought you could have more, but currently not. I don't think, other than up here, there are any more gems in here. Can you actually pick shit up, Sparks? Thank you, buddy. Now let's continue on. And we just have to backtrack a little ways. Backtrack, backtrack, how I like to backtrack. No one likes to backtrack, it's a lie. Now we can just go through here. And this. It actually blows up. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure when it blows up, it's supposed to open up a hole in the floor, but for some reason it didn't. But here's where you're supposed to go. This is also where the last hummingbird is. The last North American hummingbird. I could see America kill it. I see America killing off hummingbirds. Hey, thank Before you. I was captured, I recovered this egg from the enemy, sir. Well, thank you. Much appreciate. Roy. Rob Roy. And I hate that, that these levels get longer, but they don't get more eggs, you know? Oh, god damn it. There is a gem, but it's outside. No, can't believe we forgot one. Up you go. This way? No, not this way. This way. Wait, was it here? Wait, was it here? Was it this lava? No, there's there's no window. Oh, I know, I know exactly where it is. It's it's out this other way because there's a window. There's not very many places to find lava, so you know you're just like, well, is it here? Is it here? Is it there? Wait, there's also gems over here apparently. We're not just. We're the only ones that I missed. Ah, no! Nuts! There, oh, wait. Wait a minute. There's lots of green gems just wandering around here. Holy cow. Wait, what? There's more. Guys, there's more gems. Man, normally I'm, I'm not missing this many gems. Probably because my eyes are sore today. Haha. <laughs> oh my lord, where is it? Man, where is everything? Why is this happening so much in this Let's Play? I'm tired of missing gems. 
Flap, 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 flappy bird, flappy bird. I'm the highest I can go. Wait, how many are we missing? Ten. We're missing ten. Wait. I think I know what we're missing. I don't think it's in here at all. Wait, why'd you go in? I think we're missing a balloon. By the sounds of it, it's a balloon. It's not in this room. So, this way. I think I have a feeling I missed it at the beginning. I really do. Like, how else do you miss a 10? Uh huh. Alright, maybe not. Maybe. Hmm. Yeah, this is all we're getting done in this episode, guys. I apologize, but something is not cooperating with me. Wait a minute! For some reason, Sparks is not picking it up. There we go. There are all the gems. All the gems are mine. Thank you! God, that was annoying. Well, in the next episode, I guess we'll do more, guys.